Namaskar friends. Today we will see what is this pre-diabetic. 33% problem. This is a 33%. What is that? One out of three adults are pre-diabetics. This is the status in the US. And then nine out of 10 are unaware of their problem. It's not a rocket science to know whether somebody is pre-diabetic or not. How come a country like America with such advanced medical technologies and at the same time people who are educated and well off, they are unaware of it? We will examine that today, friends. See, for knowing pre-diabetics, a very simple HbA1c test, which in India costs only 250 rupees, right? And if the, your HbA1c is below 5.7%, and your fasting sugar is say below 99, you are considered to be healthy and you're not having non diabetic You're not having any diabetic or pre-diabetic. Now, why so? Why people are not knowing? We will look at examine that. But the bigger problem, what is the bigger problem? 90% problem. We are talking about 33% problem itself appear to be so huge, but there is a 90% problem which we are not seeing. It is something like an iceberg. What is visible? on the sea surface is very small, but what is inside is a very large one. So 90% problem is nine out of 10 adults are insulin resistance. 90% of the urban population is having insulin resistance. And interestingly, most of them are unaware. Means almost 95, 100% people are unaware they are having uh, insulin resistance. What insulin resistance will cause friends? Insulin resistance will cause fatty liver, diabetes, pre-diabetes, diabetes, heart diseases, dementia, stroke, high cholesterol, high blood pressure, PCOS, all those things are caused. Right, friends? Now, why people are not knowing? Let's look at the reasons. In the first place, uh, the human body is so wonderfully designed, it will not have any problem. Even 50% of your organs are not performing its fullest. So that means what a person who is overweight, 30, 40 kgs weight, have a large waist size also, he feels he's all right. He feels, no, no, I have no problem. But first of all, having overweight, large waist size is a clear indication that he has insulin resistance. And many times we have seen people who are not diabetic at all. Their HbA once is below 5.6%, but they had high cardiovascular problems and there are occasions people have gone in for stents and bypass surgery also. Why? Because they have not checked this 90% problem, friends. Why so? As I explained to you, the miracle body has a wonderful capability. Despite it losing its capability to a large extent, there is no symptoms. The second thing is there's something called insulin test, fasting insulin test, which is not part of it. Look at it, friend. This is the diabetic, uh, you know, approach to know where is the a person is diabetic or not, but there's no insulin talk at all. Most of the mainstream medica medic uh, medical fraternity is not... Uh, focused on this insulin test and insulin resistance rates. Let's look at it. This fasting blood glucose is, uh, is always maintained for many, many years below, uh, you know, 99. So what happens, the body works well between 70 to 120 milligrams of deciliter sugar levels, right? When you don't eat, it'll be around 70. When you eat after two hours, it should be 120. For many years, maybe 5, 10, 15, 20 years, the body is designed to maintain the sugar levels. What are we doing? We are trying to check this level and trying to find out the problem. But what we need to check, friend, insulin, fasting insulin. So the insulin is going up in the early stage itself. Look at this, uh, HbA1c has gone up only after maybe 10, 15 years of a person. But within a year or two, you can see he's already insulin resistant and insulin is going up like this. So we are not checking that, friends. So friends, it's necessary that you have to tackle your 90% problem that can be tackled very easily by way of getting fasting insulin test, fasting sugar test, and HbA1c test. Once you do this, you can calculate uh, HOMA, IR insulin resistance by multiplying fasting sugar and uh, by fasting insulin divided by 405, the value should be below 1.5. If you are 1.5, you're insulin sensitive. If you are above 1.5, you are bound to get all the problems. Maybe somebody has got only pre-diabetes, somebody has a cardiovascular problem or blood pressure and all that. Friends, let's tackle the 90% problem which is being ignored. Friends, my name is Gangeshwar Rao. I am not a doctor. 
people with health issues must consult their doctor before embarking on my advice people have joined my wellness secrets group and they can improve their health free of cost at one time my health score was 10 percent friends i'm now 80 percent last eight years eight and a half years i have not taken a medicine i was earlier taking 11 medicine for diabetes hypertension high triglycerides kidney stone and all that you must invest time to improve your knowledge friends knowledge and discipline are the gateways to your health thank you very much for listening if you like this video please subscribe share and there are other videos please listen to them enhance your knowledge and be disciplined thank you very much